is Teresa Croft coming at you. Last week we talked about how not to be an AWS online. Excuse me if that part uh, offends you. This week we're going to talk to you about how to be a star online. Hey, I'm Teresa Croft. I'm co-founder of the Kingdom Messenger Network.com. We have a real passion to help people like you spread your message with purpose for promotion and profits. Talking about social media and the proper behavior. We don't want you to be an AWS. We want you to be a star on social media. How do you do that? Let's take the word star. S, you need to have a servant's heart. It's real simple. I mean, you really need to serve. It's a basic business principle. It's beautiful. Serve people. T, you need to know your target audience. You need to know the flock. You need to find their target audience and speak their language. If I'm selling chainsaws, I'm not going to go over to the ladies who crochet and try to sell a chainsaw. I know that sounds really out there, but knowing your target audience is crucial. You speak their language, and let me tell you, you'll be a star to them. Number eight, I can't say it enough. You've got to be authentic. You've got to be real. Don't fake it till you make it. People are really savvy online. They can tell on social media if you're faking it. If you're trying to put on this persona that you're not like that, people are really smart. They can tell a fake, and you need to be real. You need to not be afraid to let the real you come out. I mean, part of me being authentic is doing videos in my car, but I'm being a good girl, and I'm in a school place, see, so I'm seated. R, we end with R, you need to be respectful of all people. You know, sometimes you can get in a verbal clash online. People just don't like what you have to say. It, it could be from your Christianity to the product you have. Be respectful. Don't get in a clash. Walk in respect and reverence of all people of all faiths. Finally, that'll make you be a star. But personally, for me, personally, uh, to be a star online, I have to let the morning star rise up inside my heart, and that's my relationship with God. If, if you are wanting to spread your message and, and your message has anything uh, to do with respect and honor in your relationship with God, you know, stay close to Him. He will make you a star because the morning star is alive in you. Uh, I'd like to serve you. I'd like to be a star for you. And one way I do that is I, I serve with giving video tips. I've laid out a new series, five key video tips on using video and how you can uh, impact your flock and make a, a difference in someone's life. So check the link below, just a way for me to serve you. Because see, I'm passionate. I know you are a star. I know you have a message that someone is waiting to hear. It might be a book, it might be a product, it might be a service, it might be your ministry. It might be the very gifts that God has placed deep in your heart since birth. Don't let fear keep you from spreading your message to be a morning star, to light the way for someone who needs you. Be a star. Till the next video, I, I don't know, I, I might be sitting still or I might not even be in my car. I'll talk to you again soon. God bless you.